mother's love is unconditional. Nothing can compare to a mother's love. The way she cares for you. The things she does, just so you can smile. How she works so hard to give you a better life. All of those things and more. That's how much a mother loves her child. Meet Jill. A single mother who works three jobs every day. His husband, Louis, left her when she was still pregnant with Jaya. He made her believe that he would be with her forever. His promises went down the drain when he ran off with his mistress, a younger girl. And Louis kicked her out of the house where they were living. He didn't care if she was pregnant or would die of hunger and cold. Her husband dumped her without even a penny. She found a shelter to stay in every night while looking for a job to get by. She got lucky and found a janitorial job inside an office cafeteria. Jill did her very best to make sure she could bring home some food for her daughter waiting at the shelter. For a year, she did her best to save money and pay for a place of their own. Jill and Jaya eventually got a place of their own to rent after working three jobs every day. Jill wanted to ensure that her daughter would never go hungry and homeless again. She worked so hard even though sometimes she felt tired and hungry. All Jill could think about was her dream of giving a good life to her daughter. She wanted to give Jaya a comfortable life, even if it meant she'd work harder every day. She is ready to do everything for her daughter, Jaya. Jaya is a student in high school who always gets high grades. She's not only intelligent, but she's also pretty and pleasant. The other students love her, and she's friends with the famous and rich girls in school. Almost every afternoon after school, her friends take her on shopping sprees and dinner out in a fine dining restaurant. They always ride in a luxurious car driven by a uniformed chauffeur. She loves the feeling of luxury and an affluent lifestyle. She always dreamed of living the life of the rich and being able to buy everything she wanted without having to think about the budget. Lately, Jill noticed that Jaya had been acting differently. She always asks for expensive stuff and wants to go out with her friends every Friday night. Jill tried explaining to Jaya that they could not afford all of those things, but Jaya didn't care and she only wanted what she wanted, no matter what the cost. One day, Jaya asked Jill if she could have an iPhone 13 because all of her friends are using it, and it's the latest trend in their school right now. Plus, she wanted to be in style with her friends. Jill knew that it was too expensive for them. But since Jaya kept on asking for it, Jill had no choice but to look for another job to buy the phone for her daughter to keep her happy. She doesn't want to disappoint her beloved daughter. Jill worked four times more than usual, with barely enough time to eat and rest. It did not take long before Jill got sick because of the fatigue brought on by working too much. She was overworked and physically drained, but all Jaya could think about was getting the phone she wanted. She still did not care about how hard her mother worked for them. Not long after, Jill was hospitalized. Even when she's in a hospital bed, the hardworking mother still thinks of her daughter and her dream phone. Jaya heard that her mother had used the money for her phone for hospital bills. She was angry and she couldn't believe her mother could be so selfish. Jaya went to the hospital to see her mother. When she arrived at Jill's room, she saw how pale and tired her mother was. Jaya can see the sadness and stress on her mom's face. Jaya realized how much her mother loved her and would do anything to give her what she wanted. Jaya then promised herself that she would change for the better and become a good daughter to her mother. She now helps her mother with the household chores, spends more time with her, and learns how to value the hard-earned money of her mom. A mother's love and sacrifice are unconditional, and they are more than willing to accept hardships to make their children happy. Let's learn how to value our mothers, for they are the light of our lives and the source of our love.